What's up my YouTube family? It is Curtis Wayne for Shea Marsh B Club back with another video. Today, we're gonna to be talking about a few things out of a book that I read from a guy named Napoleon Hill. I'll be referring a lot to Napoleon Hill and I'll be referring to a lot of different people, um, you know, different authors and their books that I've read. Um, just to kind of give you guys the information, kind of fill you in, kind of keep you um, uplifted. Um, also, you know, kind of spread out some of the music business stuff that I've read as well. And um, just put that stuff out there for those that are interested in it, all right? So today, we're gonna be touching on a little bit, um, a little tidbit out of Napoleon Hill's book, Think and Grow Rich. And it's a section in that book where he was talking about um, stopping three feet before you reach gold right so basically what this whole analogy is is you know you, you you're trucking away you're trucking away at something right and you just get so fed up because you feel like nothing is happening you know you're you're you feel stuck and then you give up but you were only three feet from actually reaching your goal actually having that breakthrough that breakthrough that we are all looking for no matter what it is you do in life whether if you're a nurse, whether if you're going to school, whether if you're a music producer or an artist or a painter, um, no matter what it is that you're, that you're trying to accomplish in life, a lot of times we get bombarded with a lot of things, we feel down, we get depressed, we get stressed, and then we give up. And then it's like, man, only to find out that you were only like three feet away from that goal. So he just pretty much gave a story of a guy that was working an oil field, right? So he was digging trenches, digging up oil fields. Actually, it was a mine, you know, a mine, um, mining for gold. And um, the guy was just going and going and he never hit gold, right? So he gave up, he sold the business off. Another guy comes along, he moves over three feet from where the first guy was digging and bam, he hits gold. <laughs> so basically that's how life works for everybody, man. We, we may just be digging in the wrong spot. We may just be looking at the wrong page at that specific time, but you know, only to find out that man, only if we would have went a couple of pages further or if we would have moved over a couple of feet and dug in a different spot, you know, kind of change things up a little bit to find your way, to find your gold. Sorry, I was closing my eye. My eye was burning a little bit. It's a little late. So, <laughs> but um, yeah, basically just don't give up, man. Don't be a failure. He calls failure temporary defeat. A lot of people think failure is just, it's over with, it's done. I've said this in one of my other vid videos, one of my previous videos. But failure doesn't mean you're done. It doesn't have to mean you're done. You can only you can look at it as just temporary defeat. I'm temporarily defeated, but that's okay. I'm gonna get up, brush myself off, and keep going. All right. This video is not gonna be too long. It's a short video. It's just a small talk. Uh, on my next um, Monday video, I'll be talking about some music business Monday talk. Um, we'll be talking about some producer. Uh, we'll, we'll, and if you guys like this content, make sure you comment, like, make sure you subscribe, leave your comment. Let me know if you like this type of content and then I'll continue with this. You know, I'll make a little series out of out of chapters and certain books that I've read and give you that information. All right. So like I said, this video is not going to be too long. I just wanted to let you know you're not a failure. Make sure you keep pushing. You know, if you're digging, digging, digging and you're 20 feet down, you may need to go over two feet, three feet, you know, to hit your goal, all right? So you're not a failure. It's just only temporary defeat. Get up, brush yourself off. Man, it's Curtis Wayne for Shea Marsh B Club, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.